do personally is to take and use, and use criticism and apply it to whatever it is I'm trying to do. Take, for example, a year ago. I decided to move barns, which was a huge step for me, because it was wrenching me completely out of my comfort zone and forcing me to find what I truly wanted. And little did I know how much it would change my life. The very first barn I wanted to try out was the highest on my list, one of the most competitive barns in Northern California, feeding at the most elite double-A horse shows. So of course, so of course it was number one on my list. The day of my quote-unquote trial lesson, I arrived, ready, confident, and honestly, now that I think about it, kind of cocky. Ready to prove myself to the people who would obviously put me in the highest level of competition and run to schedule that they have. Needless to say, that idea did not work. <laughs> in a way, I was kind of used to getting what I wanted on my old barn. Jumping large heights, cutting my corners, literally and figuratively, for those of you who are stuck-eyed. And mainly focusing on show rather than style and depth of, no of knowledge of the actual sport and horse. That first lesson just really knocked me off my pedestal and taught me more than just how to complete a few exercises. Amanda, my first instructor and mentor for the next few years, had taught me to do a few exercises that I thought were completely below me and my level. I completed them all twice without precision, truly acting like I knew how to do everything. When I redid the exercises after my first round, I didn't take any of her constructive criticism. I continued to stay in my own comfort zone and do what I thought would work. I wasn't wrong. In my more outgoing and honestly uh, better 